Well, we have the most perfect day for you. A warm hello in every sense of the word. The sun is out and football has a special place on this most idyllic of days. A fixture ahead of us to which we've all been looking forward for so very, very long. And it means so very, very much. The scene could not be more beautiful. The pitch looks terrific. The players are ready to get started. And we cannot wait for the contest that lies ahead. It is a venue this which simply adds to the spectacle of the game it stages. One of the most impressive arenas in this part of the world. It is our understanding that they've gone with a 4-5-1. Well, it's a formation, Peter, that lends itself to good possession and control in midfield because you've got the numbers there, a higher concentration. Backing that up with enough attacking dynamism is down to managers who want to get at teams. It can be used in cautious terms too, but certainly if you want to advance a little quicker and you have that attitude, then you can be very positive about this too. There's the whistle, and here we go. He's away! Shooting chance! Oh, just lacked a decent finish. Plays it out to the wing. Great run on the overlap here. Lovely bit of skill there. Crosses it in. Goalkeeper's no ball. And it's been given away. And the finish! And he's done it! It is a good finish. The odds were against him. Little matter. Well, I think that defence there thought they were in good position and they had him where they wanted, yet somehow he's worked the scoring position when it didn't see him on. It's really crafty business, though. So we have our breakthrough. Still a fragile lead, though. They can't afford to sit on this. Done very well to intervene. Hoists it forward. Good to pay. We're already chasing the game. Long time to go. The only consolation at this stage is that they've got a lot of time on their side. You try to find a positive for any eventuality, and while an early concession is unwanted, they can recover this. Plenty waiting in the middle. There's the cross. Jerome proving impossible to wrestle off the ball. Just brushed off the ball there. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. And it's played forward. Yeah. 
Out to the left it goes. Gilabogi. Forward it goes. Tries to get it forward quickly. And it's played forward. Good to pay, are still behind as we reach out for half-time. Forward it goes. Oh, good interception. The ball has crossed the line, and it's a throw. It's a loose ball. The referee's had a look, and he's blown his whistle for half-time. So there you have it, a close sport half of football, but Rugby still had its moments, but ultimately produced just one goal. Not a decent game up to now. Not the most convincing of displays, they could certainly do much better than this. They'll want to keep things simple, build up their confidence and not rush into mistakes. And we're already back on the way here. Gustepe need to get the balance right to sort this out. Ambition must be complemented by just the right amount of caution, and I think the more experienced players can oversee that. And he's got the ball glued to his feet. Oh, he's caught him there, it's a free kick. Ball. Who's going to get that? That'll be a throw. Loses his balance and loses the ball. Here it comes. And again, they run up against stubborn defending. So, Jim, what are you thinking? Well, the stats are pretty telling here. It's hard to argue with the scoreline when you carry so little threat. to get it forward quickly. He's in, surely! Has a hit! He's done very well to get to that. For what can I say? Truly wonderful goalkeeper. So sit forward.
Gorgeous control there. He's had a shot! There's a real appetite from them to finally put this game to bed, but will they? There's a long ball. It's a ball kick. The leveller or the knockout blow. Either way, it's got to happen right away. All they need is one big chance, and it may do the trick. Peter, they have to fight the onset of desperation and keep enough cool heads to still deliver. Jerome gets into a dangerous position. Referee looks at his watch and blows his whistle. Always in the balance, and in the end, one goal was enough. They are narrowly beaten. Any reflections on what you've seen, Jim? It's just a bad day at the office.